unless you've been living under a box or in a cave or in Siberia somewhere, you know that there was a big rally in Richmond. And um, there's still a lot of debate about how many people attended. Um, but I was one of them. And some people say there was 20,000. 20, some people say there was 50,000. Some people say there was upwards to 150,000. But anyway, I went there. And um, I went there not knowing what to expect. I mean, I wonder if it would be another Charlottesville. I wondered if, you know, some crazy idiot would go, Stephen Paddock, would channel his inner Stephen Paddock and um, go up to a high vantage point and just start shooting people. Because they were all in a fenced off area. Well, a lot of people were in a fenced off area, but a lot of people stayed out around the, the perimeter. But I mean, it's like, even though a lot of people had guns, it was a, still a target rich environment and nobody was killed. And um, there was no riot or anything like that. I didn't see any fighting or anything like that. It just goes to show an armed society is indeed a polite society. And um, because when you're armed, people can die, and that and that people can be that that person can be you. And so when you're when you know that you have death machines in your hand, everybody has a death machine, it's like you tend to be on your best behavior and very well-mannered because you know that the other person can defend themselves and defend themselves and you know the same exact same thing and they're, they're aware of it, you're aware of it, everybody's aware of it and as a result everybody tends to get along out of necessity it's simple survival instinct anyway um, it really goes to show that it's like people came there united, I mean it's like, there was no rioting in the streets, no, nothing was looted, no one was killed. I was um, very concerned about what might happen, I didn't know what to expect, but luckily everything turned out perfectly. It was a wonderful thing, and it was one of, I was just so proud at that moment to be an American, because I saw people from all walks of life rich, poor, white, black, straight, LGBT, whatever, um, Jew and Gentile, um, for national, bo American born citizens, and, uh, foreigners. I saw people from all states and a few, a few countries. They were, they were all there. It was just a, it was just Americans uniting uniting as one. And it was just a victory for not, not just the American people, but for all of humanity. And I'm not, it, it wasn't just proud, I wasn't just proud to be an American, I was proud to be a human for once in my life. It was great. And, um, you know, it was, a lot of people were, um, I received a lot of pamphlets and a lot of things like that, and, um, I've been reading through them, but it's not, it doesn't end with this. We've got to keep this going, and I, um, want to continue that work. That's why I'm making this video. So anyway... I've made several in the past, and you can watch them if you want. But anyway, this will end my video right right about now. So, six Semper Tyrannis, Mulan Labe, and don't tread on me. Be good, y'all. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe as well.